adapting angular project development so post to this once you have installed successfully node.js and visual studio code let's flip over to visual studio code here you have an option inside view on click of this view you will find terminal once you click on this terminal it will open a new terminal for you this is a powershell where we can run angular commands so now let's start up by creating a angular project that is a sample template using which we can modify our own code and develop angular using angular okay so let's give the command so before giving any command let's check whether node has been installed successfully or not so to check whether it's installed successfully we need to run the command node hyphen v okay so this this will display the version of node that has been installed here so you can see that 12.18.4 has been installed successfully let's check npm also npm space hyphen v okay so this will display the version of npm installed in our machine okay so this is used for verifying whether node has been installed successfully in our machine or not if you are unable to find this if you are unable to on running this command if you are unable to find the version of node that has been installed here then it shows that there is some error while installing so you need to check again and install node.js again from the website which which we have provided the link over in the description okay so once this is installed successfully and once we have verified it now next step is let's create a sample project with which we can use and we can modify our own code for angular development okay that we can do by running the command ng space new space name of the project which you want to create so i want to name the project as angular project tutorial okay i want to name like this my project click on okay okay press enter button and now you can see that uh, new project will be created on running this command that is with the name angular project tutorial so on running this command we'll get an option like would you like to add angular routing at this stage let's not add this so let's give n means no so further when we are discussing about angular routing we will create our own uh, class file for it and we will discuss about it okay press enter so next you can see option for styling that is you want css or scss or sas or less or stylus so let's select css okay so once you have provided this command you can see that in terminal it's going to create the files which were required for our angular project so it's installing the packages which are required for angular project development so once this installation is completed then our sample project will be ready that is a skeleton template which we have for angular development which we can make use of it and develop our own angular project using that okay So you can observe here that the package has got installed successfully. Now these are the files which are required for Angular project development. Like uh, quick start files we can say that is startup files. So once we have the sample files we can modify the required files and make our project in our own way. So once we have the sample file, next what we will do is let's run this project and see the output of this npm space start so this command is used for running the project okay now if you observe over here when i run this command what is happening we are getting an error so why we are getting error though we have installed everything successfully and the pro project got created successfully but we have missed one thing over here that is navigating to that project we are inside source repos right but inside this we have the project folder so first we need to navigate to the project folder okay 
it is angular project tutorial so now once we are inside this project tutorial folder we need to run this command npm space start so now you can see that we are able to run the project successfully here you can observe that uh, we are able to see another command over here that is ng space serve so this command will be run automatically whenever you are running npm start so this npm start will internally call ng serve for running our project so it is getting compiled over here once it got compiled successfully it will be hosted into localhost colon 4200 so this is the port where it is going to host our project now what we will do we will open our browser and go to this localhost colon 4200 okay So when I provide localhost colon 4200, now you can see that the Angular project tutorial app is running. This shows that Angular is running successfully in our machine. So the sample project which we which we introduced over here is compiled successfully and it is running successfully in localhost colon 4200. now we have all the files required for this angular project tutorial once we have this quick start files that is startup files so next from the next video let's modify these files to make sure we develop our own angular project using this quick start files okay thank you so much for watching this video guys please like comment and share this video and kindly subscribe to my channel in order to watch more videos